Welcome back to Drinks and Chill. My name is Gio. This is Matt. And this is another episode of Whiskey Wednesday. Today we are actually going to be trying out, or well, we already tried it, but we're going to be trying again, Glen Levitt 12 Double Oak Super yeah. Malt. So. Yeah, so Glen Levitt, so that's a space side scotch. So, you know, space side is usually going to be, usually going to be like your lighter scotches, uh, not too heavy, not too smoky. Um, you know, kind of good sort of entry level scotches for folks who are just kind of getting into it. And this was our favorite scotch, remember? Back when we did the scotch tasting in Armageddon. Mm -hmm. I think this is the first time I've had Glenlivet since then. I know you've, I know you've had it a couple times because this is your bottle, but mm -hmm. um, this will be the first for me since then. Cheers. Cheers. Smells interesting. That's a very familiar smell I'm getting. Yeah. And I'm not just talking like, oh, it smells like whiskey. It's like an actual thing. Yeah. It smells like Glenlivet. Yeah. What is that? Well, that's interesting. So I'm like, when I'm drinking like at a, I guess a whiskey glass, like a, kind of like a shooter glass. Mm -hmm. You don't taste the smoke as much as you do with the glasses. You're getting smoke? Mm -hmm. Is Glenlivet peated? I didn't... Pretty not? Maybe that's just my imagination. It might be the oak, because it says matured in European oak and American oak casks. Mm -hmm. That might be what you're getting. I didn't think Glenlivet was smoked. I mean, it could be. I don't know. Well, it could be my imagination. No, it could, it could be the oak, too, because... I remember when we did the bourbon week, like, during that month, I kept saying, like, to all the rooms, Oh, yeah, this is smoky. But no, it's it was the oak. It was just oaky. Yeah, it was the oak. I feel like I am getting that oak. But there's another smell in here that oh, I know it. I've smelled this before, but I cannot put my finger on what it is. Cherry? Chocolate? No, not cherry. Not cherry. You figure it out though? No. I mean yeah, I think there is cherry, but that's not what. It is I'm getting. Maybe it is the oak. Because now I think about it, it sort of smells like woody almost. It might just be the oak. Mm. No, but the reason I looked at you like that was because um, I know you said chocolate because I said it that one time when we were doing, um, when we were tasting Macallan 12. Yeah, or like every other. And well, that was the first time that I said it, and ever since then it was just sort of like a joke because you were like making fun of me for yeah. tasting chocolate. But I watched someone else's review of Macallan 12 on YouTube. Mm -hmm. They said chocolate. Oh really? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, I think it is just the woody oak I'm getting from this. That's good. Tastes a lot better with these. Yeah. I feel like with these, I, I definitely can get a difference in the smell, but um, I don't know about the taste. Like, Cause I mean, recently this is all I drink whiskey out of, like the, the larger Glen Kearns, mm -hmm. but. Mm. Yeah, I need to get one of these, like the larger glasses. Cause yeah. Tastes a lot, lot different. But I remember, during that scotch week, I think it was pretty close between this one and the Glenfiddich. So. <laughs> Did you want to try the Glenfiddich for comparison? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we can do it. Yeah. Alright, so we got the Glenfiddich 12 here. And this is just another sort of uh, classic space side. And we actually drank this recently um, in our the video we did about the five different Regions of mm -hmm. Scotch. Thank you. But I remember when we did the actual tasting, it was really neck and neck, and ended up going with Glenlivet. I think we both chose Glenlivet as our favorite. This place is much lighter. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah, you can tell right away, it's a lot lighter. Much sweeter.
I like to go in a little bit better. You do? I don't know. I feel like it's still neck and neck for me. I probably do give the edge to Glenn Levitt just because I think it has a little bit more going on with it. Mm -hmm. um, but I mean, this, there's nothing wrong with this. No, thing. it's not. Should we go ahead and add Glenn Levitt to the, uh, the Infinity Bottle? The Infinity Bottle. So if I was rating Glenn Levitt on a scale of 1 to 10, See, that's difficult for me because I feel like for what it is, <laughs> I feel like for what it is, it's really good. <laughs> I guess we use the funnel next time. No, but I think for what it is, the Glenn Livid is, is good. It's just not really, like, I don't think it's the one that I would reach for first. Mm -hmm. um, oh, in terms of, like, the scotch? Yeah. Because I feel like I do like scotch that has a little bit of smoke to it. Mm -hmm. And, I mean, I know you were tasting smoke, but I, I, I really think that's the oak coming through. Um, so for me, I'd probably give Glenlivet a... I'd give it like a seven and a half. Mm, okay. I want to say eight. Eight? Yeah. Like, all the scotch flavors are really, really good. Mm-hmm. Like, for the flavors, you can't go wrong. It's just a preference of, do you like that? Yeah. Smoke taste, or do you like that oak wood taste? Just kind of like, what what is your, like, what, what taste do you have? Yeah. And I feel like that's what, what I'm really trying to do with when we, when we rank these, just, it's just based solely on how do I like it? Like, not like, oh, well, you know, it's, it's, I'm expecting it to taste this way and it met my expectation or didn't meet my expectation. Mm -hmm. This is not a objective rating. It's totally subjective. I think I use those words right. <laughs> Opinionated. Yeah, exactly. It's an opinion. Nothing more than that. That is our review of Glen Levitt 12 Double Oak. Yep. Tell us what you think about it. Do you like it? Do you like the... or have you tried it? Or if you would try it? I say it's definitely worth a try. This one is usually pretty easy to find in the smaller bottle size, so I, I think it's definitely worth the buy. Oh, yeah. yeah. Little, what, what are they called? Tasters? I don't know yeah, like, well, even like this bottle. size bottle or like the little sample size ones. They have this size? Mm -hmm. I think this one, they only have this one and those samples, don't they? No, they have, I've seen like this size bottle of Glenlivet. Oh, okay. Yeah. Whatever you think, what do you think about Glenlivet? What is your favorite space side scotch? Uh, answer that down in the comments and, uh, you know, if it's one that we have or can get our hands on fairly easily, maybe we try it. Yep. Until right. next time. Till next time. Bye. Bye.